you may say to me, Kevin, I have unforgiveness for a person, bitterness, anger, or whatever. How can I forgive that person? Because I am having a very difficult time forgiving that person. Okay. In the past, I used to hate people so much. So much. I am serious. And I think it is a miracle that I am not that way now. I am serious. I used to have so much bitterness and anger for people, so much. Okay, you may ask me, what can you do to get rid of it? I believe when I started, I forget when, I used to have hate for a certain person. And it was like something was urging me, not in like a very aggressive way, like Kevin, you know, do this, do that. No, like in like a gentle way, I guess I can say, like in a gentle way, urging me, I believe it was urging me to do things for a person I hated. Not like in a loud or aggressive or mean way, like, like how a friend may do, you know? Like, hey, Kevin, you know, I think you should, you know, blah, blah. You know, like in a nice, gentle way. I believe it was the Holy Spirit. I believe so. Urging me to give to that person, buy this person this, be there for that person. And for a while, I believe I did not want to do it. I did not. I believe I did not even want to be around that person, that person much. And I still, <laughs> maybe I should not say that. So <laughs> let me not say I did not want to be around that person. But as time passed by, and I was doing for that person more than one time, I believe more than 10 times, I believe more than, I don't know. I think as time passed by, that hatred I had for that person went away. Then I started to do it toward other people, doing for them, whether they deserved it or not, doing for them, doing this for them, doing that for them. And I believe the same thing started to happen to where that hate, that unforgiveness started to leave or left, I believe. Maybe I should say started to leave. Okay. Now, I am at the point I believe that I think God has reshaped my heart, if you understand what I am trying to say, to the point to where I love so easily so easily you can cuss me out you can be rude to me 
you can slash my tires and please don't do that. I am still going to love you. I am serious. You can cuss my mama out and I am still going to love you. Now, I may not want to be around you much, but I am still going to love you. It's like God has done something to my heart or something to where I get mad, but like, <laughs> how can I explain this? It's like my heart is new if that makes any sense. Like my heart is not the same as it was in the past. I probably could be like that again, but I would probably have to go against so much that is in me to be that way again, probably. So you may say, Kevin, what is your point? What do you want me to do? Okay. Do what I am telling you. Do for the people you hate. Do for the people you despise. Kevin, it is so hard. I understand that. But I believe if you continue to do it, continue to do it, continue to do it, I believe whatever that is in you against that person if I am saying that correctly, will go away. What's the sense in dying with bitterness, dying in unforgiveness, dying with, I guess I can say spite or whatever else? Can you get into heaven with that? Can you? Why even take the risk? Why? I believe I had visions of demons and I believe I had dreams about hell and stuff like that. Now, demons are not, from my understanding, demons are not playing around. And from what I know, which I don't know a whole lot demons are very vicious man they are not playing around to my understanding even in my dreams I may not have been oh. imagine having to go through that for a very long time like that type of torment is it worth it even if your mom used to smack you slap you every day even if your dad did not love you even if your dad did not take care of you even if your parents was harsh to you i don't believe you want to go to hell i am so serious even if everyone on this earth hated you and treated you harshly, it is not worth going to hell, I am telling you. I believe as I, I believe I am elevating in God and I think as I elevate, I think I get worse demonic attacks. And with those attacks, I guess that kind of reminds me, I don't want to go to hell. So serious, man. Like imagine having to go through your worst nightmare forever, man. Like, can you even take that? Let me stop here. God bless you. Or should I say, imagine going through your worst nightmare for a very long time. I don't think, man, let me stop here. 
God bless you.